All right, so here's a how-to video for anyone that cooks in bulk. Either you're going to cook something and then you're going to make it like four meals for yourself or you're cooking for, say, your family and you're the only one tracking macros and you're going to eat like one quarter of whatever you make. So we're going to just make uh, you know, something haphazard. I'm going to add an amount of chicken and a, an amount of, I guess, rice and then let's say green bell peppers and then I'm going to show you how to uh, create a recipe with that. So you can either click the, uh, the top left-hand corner, the three uh, lines stacked on top of each other, or you can swipe right. And so what we're gonna go here is we're gonna click on recipes, and then we're gonna do add, uh, press the little plus sign up top. Uh, for some of you uh, non-iPhone users, sometimes you have to scroll to the bottom and it'll, it'll allow you to uh, create a new recipe there, or it's gonna be up here at the top, obviously, with the, uh, the iPhone here. But I'm gonna press the little check mark, and then here we go, okay, we're gonna call this chicken whatever okay so we're gonna say okay it's gonna be four servings and now here's here's the part here's the whole the, the whole thing with it you're gonna you're gonna add your food after you weigh it out raw so if I could spell here we're gonna put in chicken um, you can plug you can plug that in and search or you can go to custom favorites and then I'm just gonna scroll down to raw chicken I'd recommend doing it this way um, if you plug it in yourself you know it's gonna be accurate if you're using the search engine, you're kind of at the mercy of how accurate they are. So here we go, raw chicken breast. I'm going to add that. I'm going to go back. I'm going to add another ingredient, and I think we said rice. Uh, I think I've got this listed under sushi rice, maybe. Uh, perhaps not. So let's find some rice in here. Um, not there. Maybe sushi rice. There we go. Okay, so uh, we're gonna add that, and then I think we said green bell pepper as well. So let's go in here, and then let's see if bell pepper is here. Perfect. We're gonna add that. So we go back, and then we're gonna, you know, let's just say we had 300 grams of chicken, and then 200 grams of bell pepper, and then say three servings of sushi rice, which would be 145, save, and then we'll save up top there. Now, we go back to the home screen and say, okay, I cooked it today, and then you know, next, uh, later on in the day, I'm gonna eat it. I go in here, I go into uh, the food menu, I go to recipes, and then I scroll down to find chicken whatever, and then I'm gonna have, uh, you know, one serving of that, and you, you have an option to either add the individual ingredients or a single item. I'm just going to hit in individual ingredients, and then those show up there. The caveat is, you know, you're going to weigh everything raw. Uh, once it's done cooking, you get to you get to weigh it again, so you can parcel out into the four servings. So that's really the only uh, trick there. So that's how to add a recipe.